Hey guys and welcome to this video. So the end of Verdansk is finally upon us and with that sees the final event of Warzone in the Verdansk era, Secrets of the Pacific. The objective is to complete 6 challenges by collecting pieces of intel from various locations described in the event. In this video we'll go over the locations of this intel and give you guys some tips to get the job done. A caveat here is that these challenges must be completed in the battle royale mode on Warzone. Plunder doesn't seem to work and I haven't tried Operation Flashback but I don't think it works in that too. The reason being is that the requirement to complete a challenge is based on surviving a specific number of circles when you collect a piece of intel and these can vary from anything between 1 and 4 circles. Upon surviving for the duration of the number of circles marked by the magnifying glass on the top of the armor symbol the challenge is completed for that location. Also, you can't collect more than one piece of intel at a time, but you can pick up the same one or another one if you die and come back, provided it is still available and someone else hasn't already picked it up. This challenge can be quite frustrating because it depends on how long you need to survive. So the first piece of intel is called Jailbreak and is located in prison, in the Gulag shower room, near the back of the room, above the tunnel entrance. And it's a ping pong bat. The second one, called On The Air, is in the electronic store in Promenade, on the shelf at the back of the store, if you enter from the main doors. The third one, called Fast Food, is in the burger restaurant counter on the second floor of airport. And the fourth, On Your Feet, is in the main building of hospital in the operating room, and the entrance is a side door near one of the zips. The fifth one, called Abandoned, and possibly the hardest to get, is underneath the mines near the outskirts of airport, and is located underneath the zip and is a stick of dynamite. And the last called Secrets is in one of the bunkers under the containers. Now I'm not sure if all the bunkers have it, but I went to the one near Array and you need to look out for these small models of toy ships. So after you collect these, then comes the actual tricky part, which is to survive. Now if you get one which only requires you to survive for one or two zones, you're in luck. Because if you're in centre zone, all you need to do is just camp it out somewhere. And hey, by the way, I'm not judging anyone here. You have to do what's required in order to complete the challenge. But here's the tricky part. Certain ones like the one in hospital and I think airport require you to survive for three or four circles. So what I did was to play duos. And if you have a squad, that's even better because safety in numbers. So what I did was to get a chopper and basically stay edge of zone and creep in with the zone. So here I was playing duos, but my random teammate left so I basically went from power position to power position to ensure I survive at any cost. So the airport one was the trickiest because I actually died the first time I got it because I accidentally picked up a most wanted and got pushed. But then I came back and had to do it all over again and this time it was during the end game. And I just about managed to complete it. But persistence is key. If you have a good squad and know how to rotate, you'll be fine. The key here is to play edge of zone and the short side of the ring to clear your backs. Or a risky approach is to do the equivalent number of recon contracts as the number of circles required for survival. Find the center zone and take up a power position until you complete the challenge. So I hope you found this video useful. If you have, please leave a like and I might also do the challenge for Vanguard provided it's working as I've heard it's causing the game to crash. And with that, that's the end of this video and thanks for watching.